The Discovery Head Office project entailed the development of an iconic structure in the Senton Precinct. The structure consists of three towers with glass facades and large skylight roofs on the two larger towers. This required extensive steelwork support for the facades at roof level and between the three towers. A major construction challenge presented by the design was the requirement to effectively pre-stress the main and secondary trusses post-installation to ensure their bottom cords remain in tension under all loading conditions. The pre-stress is achieved by the incorporation of light pull-down bars, which were then post-tensioned on the main support trusses after installation using purpose-made tensioning brackets and permanently installed strain gauges to ensure correct tensioning was applied. The facade support structure requires a 200 by 200 by 4.5 square hollow section to follow the three-dimensional curvature of the top edge of the buildings. You can see that steel is, is very versatile in its use and the designers and developers who actually understand it seem to be using it in also very versatile ways uh, to solve uh, essentially problems that otherwise would not be solved. The entire structure was erected to tight tolerances required by the facade placing contractor and finished to the high standard required by the architect. Each of the 11 feature spiral staircases consists of double box stringers 600 mm deep which alternated between glass and plate balustrades. The stairs span from floor to floor with no intermediate support hence the requirement for full penetration site welding to cast in channel systems to handle the eccentric loads. The sheer scale of the project, it's quite daunting both from the outside and inside. It just stands out, there's just opulence to it. A key feature of the building is the floating nose of the West Tower, which projects over the Catherine and Ravonia intersection. To make a statement that fitted with the scale of the building, the project team needed to cantilever 17.5 meters over six floors. This posed a significant structural challenge that was eventually solved with the introduction of three massive concrete beams. The floors are then suspended from these beams using concrete-filled steel columns. For the full project profile, technical specifications and project team details, click on the world icon in the Steel Awards app or visit www.saisc.co.za. Congratulations to the Discovery Head Office project team, winners of the architectural category for the SAISC Steel Awards 2018.